Switzerland Tourism invites the Indian travel trade to learn more about Jungfrau Railways in its next webinar on Friday, the 24th of September at 3 p.m. ATOAI organized a national awareness webinar. If we are going to only talk in a very generic way and say this is what needs to be done across India, it doesn't really create a workflow sheet. What we really need to do is to target 5, 10, 20 destinations and say these are those 10 or 15 or 20 that I must immediately work on. I think that's that will give us a more granular approach to the whole thing. The larger picture which is emerging, there is enough for everyone to share grow and preserve together. We need to ensure that the local communities are not exploited and systems are put in place by the governments of every state. Travel Bulls shares its recent developments. We've just launched a dynamic packaging engine which now helps travel agents to book their Maldives product along with transfers on a click of a button. It's one of the easiest user interface launched where customers can uh, immediately issue vouchers on real-time basis without waiting to send emails or WhatsApps to any of the suppliers. Another uh, extremely uh, new initiative uh, which we've developed over the last uh, six months is to build the world's largest uh, marketplace in travel business, especially in B2B, where we're going to connect uh, destination management companies with the travel agents worldwide. To easy the visa process to India, the government of India has developed a user-friendly application, Su Swagtam. Scheduled airlines in India are allowed to operate up to 85% of their pre-COVID capacity on domestic flights. Indigo to start Agra Lucknow flights from the 1st of October.